get back to the timing of the blowing up, the explosion out there in the Gulf of Mexico of this oil rig. Lest we forget, since, since they're sending SWAT teams down there now, this changes the whole perspective of this. Now, lest we forget, ladies and gentlemen, the carbon tax bill, cap and trade, that was scheduled to be announced on Earth Day. I remember that. And then it was postponed for a couple of days later, after Earth Day, and then, of course, the uh, immigration has now moved in front of it. But this bill, the cap-and-trade bill, was was strongly criticized by hardcore environmentalist wackos because it supposedly allowed more offshore drilling and nuclear plants, nuclear plant investment. So... Since they're sending SWAT teams down there, folks, since they're sending SWAT teams to inspect the other rigs, what better way to head off more oil drilling, nuclear plants, than by blowing up a rig? I'm just, just noting the timing here. From the Hill, about the Senate bill, Sierra Club Chief Michael Bruin, or Bruni, told the Hills E2 Wire, we will go to the mat for defending Clean Air Act authority. Bruni also pointed to another potential stumbling block in the cap-and-trade bill, offshore drilling. We're not be able to accept the dramatic giveaway that offshore oil drilling represents. The, the, the five hurdles the climate bill must clear, and one of them is offshore drilling. That's in the Hill.com.